Hello and welcome to another Royal Caribbean blog unboxing where we take something that we've gotten from eBay and unbox it live on Periscope. We actually broadcast these on Periscope first and we put it out here to YouTube, Facebook and all our favorite social media channels. So of course you can follow us on Periscope by following the RCL blog on Periscope so you can do that. But uh, of course all, our all of our unboxings rather are being sponsored by our good friends at MEI Travel. If you want to plan a Royal Caribbean cruise vacation, well then my friends, you want to check out MEI Travel. I've got some great folks that are here to help you get the best possible vacation experience, save you money, and make your life a whole lot easier. Check them out right now at meitravel.com. And here we are with our mystery unboxing for today. And here it is. It is a little bit smaller in size than we've, current, we've got before. And as I said earlier to some of the folks on Periscope, I don't think you would ever guess what this is. Because when I saw it on eBay, I knew I, I, I just had to get it. Because it was so odd that it just had it. So let me uh, show you the, the package here. It weighs, tell me how much it weighs here. 11 ounces. It is not a bundle of $100 bills. I wish it was that. I would not have spent that much money. It's not a lunchbox. It's very small. Here's my hand for comparison. You can see a lunchbox far too small for that. Um, <laughs> so here we go. Let's, uh, let's start opening this bad boy up, shall we? I've got my official... Uh, Royal Caribbean blog unboxing opener knife that I stole from my kitchen that I've never given back yet. And we will attempt without injuring myself. It's not poker chips. <laughs> oh boy. Let's get the outer packaging out of here to reveal another box. It's a box within a box. <laughs> okay. I don't know if this makes it any, uh, Yes, dangerous knife usage. Only only trained professional unboxers should use this. It is just another box. I gotta open up another one. Yes. I should just end it now and be like, tune in next week for the unboxing of the unboxing. All right, we'll keep going here. What could it be? Man, they put a lot of tape in this. I'll tell you this that much. The person who shipped this put a lot of thought into it. All right. Here we go. I'm just going to show you a preview. What do you think this is? It is not cookies. It is not Russian nesting boxes. That's a good guess, though. I like that one. Not a coffee mug. Remember, this is something I don't think you would ever guess. So, honey sun chicken. I wish it was chicken. All these, uh, of course, guesses are coming from Periscope, so big up to see the Periscope people out there. It's not honey sun chicken. All right, here we go. Ready? Three, two, one. Boom. What is it? It is a 1985 Royal Caribbean Cruise Line collectible transistor radio. It is not snakes in a can. And it's kind of hard to see with the glare here if I try to shield it a little bit. You can kind of see it's got the Royal Caribbean logo on it. It's got the old uh, name, Royal Caribbean Cruise Line. It has on the back of it. Uh, the ships that were in the fleet at the time. So we've got Song of Norway, Nordic Pride, Sun Viking, and Song of America. This is now, I got to read the description for you from eBay because I thought this was so cool. A 1985 transistor radio from Royal Caribbean Cruise Lines, used sparingly back in 1985, and since then, it has been in storage for the past 30 years. Does it work? It's supposed to work. Let's try it. First of all, let me preface this by saying I have no clue how to use a transistor radio. I've only heard of them in songs well before my time. Let's see. I don't hear anything. I think I've got the volume up. I don't know how this thing is supposed to work. How does a transistor radio work? <laughs> Well, you can see here the speaker kind of comes off. Is there a battery? That's the only thing I can think of. Like, how does this thing get power, right? Ah, we got to attach the battery. Hold on a second. Let me turn it off. So you can see here the uh, connector is not connected to the 9-volt battery, so we will connect it. It works! And you can hear, I am an eight, a child of the 80s. Now, how do you tune this thing? Come on, don't fail me now. I got the dial, now I'm trying to get a signal. CWCU said GDO's mission was not a corporate decision 
There you go. You got something. NPR News. How about that? Don't forget to drink your old So how cool is that? There's our unboxing. A 1985... I don't know. I guess I'll turn it off for right now. A 1985 tr Royal Caribbean transistor radio, which begs the question, why did they give away transistor radios in 1985? I don't know. But how cool. A little piece of history here. So I hope you enjoyed that. And of course, I want to thank our partner and friend at MEI Travel, or sponsor for this event. All of our unboxings are being sponsored by, of course, MEI Travel. So if you want to uh, book a Royal Caribbean cruise, I highly recommend checking out MEI Travel. They're a great agency. They're going to help you save money, make your life easier and everything else more gooder in the world. Check them out right now at meitravel.com. And of course, all of our unboxing videos, we broadcast live on Periscope first. So big shout out to the Periscope people. Woo! You guys are awesome. And we're going to hang out here on Periscope a little bit later, but for a little bit more rather. But and tune into our next unboxing video here on royalcaribbeanblog.com. Bye, everybody.